Okay, to install RAM, generally you would open up your computer case. Again, make sure you're grounded so that anything that you touch on the motherboard does not get statically shocked and automatically made into a paperweight. Uh, the first thing that you want to do is locate where the RAM goes. So, in my case, uh, we have the CPU here. This is where this big giant heatsink is. Uh, and then to the left, or sometimes across the bottom, very near to the processor, you'll see a couple of slots, long slots like this. And there, if there are more than two slots, you'll see them color-coded. In my case, I have blue and black. And uh, that's for when you uh, put more than one stick of RAM in there, you need to match up the size with each slot. So slots one and three go together. So if I had two 512 megabyte sticks, I'm gonna make sure that they go here. And if I had gigabyte sticks, I want to make sure that they matched up and went to slots two and four. So basically, make sure that you're grounded and snap in the, the uh, memory modules. And they will snap in, and then these two, uh, these white latches here will snap into place. And there are notches on the memory modules that will snap with the latches here. They're pretty universal. Um, if they don't fit, do not force them in. <laughs> Flip them around. Because even though the slots look like they're evenly spaced out between the two dividers that are in, in the plastic here, they're not. So one side is longer than the other side. So flip them around and then pop it in there. And then the white latches will come up and pop into place. Um, one thing to remember about installing memory is make sure you get the right speed of memory. Um, make sure your motherboard supports the right speed as well. So uh, if you go out and you buy 667 megahertz uh, speed memory, make sure that your motherboard can support that speed. And also, if you buy more than one stick, make sure they match in capacity. So 512 matches with 512, one gigabyte matches with one gigabyte, so on and so forth. And that's pretty much how you install memory.